Hello, everybody. Uh, nice to see uh, that so many of you uh, joined our little session uh, today. My name is Sharunas Sherika. Uh, I am product manager uh, in Ruptella, responsible for our uh, GPS tracker products, their development, uh, the roadmap, uh, the features, uh, and the market needs uh, for these products. Uh, so. We just released, as a Ruptella, we just released a new bunch uh, of new products and uh, uh, many thanks uh, to our uh, loyal customers, especially in uh, Saudi Arabia. Uh, we got lots of feedback and many functionalities uh, were developed based, basically based on feedback that we received for you. So thank you for that. Uh, so today's topic is uh, just to introduce you uh, the possibilities of our new generation devices, specifically in Saudi Arabian markets in relation to existing governmental regulations and some other uh, use cases that might bring much more value to your uh, businesses. Uh, as I see that I see some familiar uh, names as well as uh, a lot, lot of uh, new names uh, to me. So I will start uh, from introducing very briefly what is the Ruptella. Uh, then I will move to uh, our presentation of our latest generation uh, trackers that we just produced specifically, specifically uh, for uh, heavy duty vehicles. Uh, I will very briefly introduce also solution for light commercial vehicles. And uh, I will move to what we think, uh, what is essential to, to provide good fleet management solution in Saudi Arabia. And uh, I will provide examples of existing solutions that we have uh, as for today or in the nearest future that could uh, allow your businesses to grow. And of course, we could have a question and answer session afterwards. But uh, guys, uh, feel free to ask any questions uh, during the presentation. Uh, I hope that I will be able to answer them as well. With me, I have my team. So we have Amir, he's uh, already communicating. We have uh, Mindaugas uh, Pranaitis. Uh, so we have team that can back up me with uh, live uh, chat questions if you may have. So feel free to ask them. And uh, let's let's begin. So very briefly about Ruptella. So I hope you, you heard this name. So uh, from 2007, uh, we are one of the biggest uh, fleet management hardware uh, providers uh, Hardware providers. Uh, we are based in Lithuania. Lithuania. Uh, we have headquarters in Vilnius, capital of Lithuania. And uh, throughout the years, we expanded to more than 120 countries. So we are uh, operating globally. Uh, we are quite uh, not that small, but not a huge corporation as well. We have over 200 employees. Uh, what differentiates us from others? We do businesses in more than 50 languages. Uh, including uh, Arabic, French, Italian, and uh, many others. So we want to talk to our customers in their own languages. And uh, we, we, we basically spread globally. So we have headquarters in Vilnius, Lithuania, and we have our offices and branches in Belarus, Ukraine, Ireland, Poland, Mexico, United States. And very recently, we just opened the office in United Arab Emirates in Dubai. So we are uh, very very local in, in Gulf uh, region. Uh, so uh, as you may see, we, we put lots of uh, efforts to bringing a really great product, a high quality product. So the majority of our, uh, basically almost the half uh, of our uh, employees are related to R&D and manufacturing. And we have huge team or operations to ensure very smooth uh, support for all our customers, so excellent service that is our aim to achieve. Uh, so today we will not speak about all of these solutions, but Ruptella has quite deep expertise and long years of experience in traditional fleet monitoring and control solutions in uh, driver behavior monitoring, uh, vehicle cargo and driver safety and security, uh, fuel related solutions, uh, and uh, shared mobility solutions that we have today. Uh, as, uh, as a Ruptella. But uh, today I will focus more on our hardware solutions that can find really good use in the uh, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. 
Uh, in Ruptela, uh, what we do, we do, we can provide a full solution to our customers. So we we we, do, we produce our own own uh, trackers, our own hardware. Uh, we develop the software on these trackers, which is called firmware. Uh, we have our own uh, software development team. And uh, what differentiates us from some other providers, we have our own uh, manufacturing. So we can control all the process, all the quality uh, of our products that we deliver. And uh, one of our key highlights is uh, extremely, extremely good quality. We have almost uh, almost OEM rated uh, quality of 99.9% uh, in hardware reliability. And we managed to achieve this kind of high quality, not by producing very few units per year, but we produce more than 300,000 of GPS trackers per year. So we managed to maintain this kind of quality. And we have already uh, one and a half million of trackers deployed on the field. So produced since the inception uh, of Ruptella, from 2007, and uh, most of them, I believe majority of them is still operational and sending data, etc. And uh, what allows us to ensure this kind of quality? So we have quite a state of art testing equipment uh, in, in, inside our R&D. We, uh, we have capabilities to do internal thermal, humidity accepted testing. Uh, we have automated uh, uh, testing. We have uh, simulation chambers to simulate uh, conditions for over the year. Uh, performance in the radio frequency chamber. So we have all the state of art equipment needed to ensure that our products are in excellent quality. And uh, just very, very quick poll that I want to, 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 to give to you. Uh, I, I just gave you a poll in the chat uh, if, if you are using Rupella products right now. So let me know uh, maybe if we have some new, uh, uh, new, 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 pe new people that are not familiar with Rupella. Okay, thank you. It's still counting. Okay, so I'm very glad to see that. Uh, uh, we have uh, people that are still not using uh, Ruptella solution, so that's why we wanted to also introduce the Ruptella bit to those who do not using that are not using Ruptella solution, and uh, as well also maybe to update our existing uh, customers with what Ruptella has uh, for today. Uh, so to start, uh, I, I will just start speaking about the product. So first of all, we just released our latest generation, fifth generation. Uh, advanced, solution, advanced solutions that are available on the market right now. And they, these solutions are available on uh, in Saudi Arabia market uh, as for today. It's fully fully available for today. Uh, we have uh, three products in that family. It's, they are called HCV5, Pro5, and LCV5. Uh, HCV5 and Pro5 are devices that are dedicated for heavy-duty vehicles, heavy-duty solutions. And LCV5, which the name suggests is light commercial vehicles, uh, light commercial vehicles. Uh, so that, about that solution, about light vehicles, I will just introduce very briefly, but today's focus is about heavy duty vehicles, which is the most uh, commonly needed solutions in Saudi Arabia, at least as what we think uh, today. Uh, I'm very glad to announce the, uh, that uh, uh, our devices uh, got a full certification, full approval, full approval from uh, Communication and Information Technology Commission of Saudi Arabia, so CITC. Uh, you know, prob you probably heard that they introduced uh, new requirements uh, uh, for uh, telecommunication equipment. So uh, we have received these certificates. Here you can see on the screen the proof that we have them, and uh, these devices are fully available. Uh, for sales and to to be used in Saudi Arabia, so that's what we have. And uh, I will just move uh, to solutions themselves. So I will speak. I will start from HCV5 and Pro5. So these are our most advanced uh, products uh, that are designed for uh, complex uh, heavy duty solutions for trailer tracking, refrigeration, uh, axle weight, and cargo conditions such as temperature or humidity monitoring solutions. So. Let's go ahead. So these devices are very suitable uh, for those customers that operate in logistic industry. So uh, logistics, uh, long haul uh, delivery and, uh, and similar activities. It's suitable for utilities such as uh, 
services, city services, uh, garbage disposal solutions, uh, etc. It is also suitable for those companies that operate large fleets of trailers. So we are able to track trailers and get uh, other relevant information about them. It's suitable to use these solutions to track heavy machinery, expensive equipment, specifically it's, it has a good use in oil mining industry or construction. And also HCV5 as a solution, it's uh, perfectly suitable to be used on the light vehicles as well. So for car rental companies, car leasing companies or corporate fleet solutions. Uh, so the device that uh, we introduced into Saudi Arabia market, so it is 4G device, uh, which operates at uh, CAT M1 connectivity. So it is the latest uh, IoT optimized network connectivity. We have full certification for this connectivity. So these devices operate on 4G connectivity. If the 4G network coverage is not available, it will automatically switch to 2G connectivity. So basically we have everything covered, all bands, all relevant bands covered by our solution. Also, the, our, all our devices, HCV, uh, Pro5, and as well as LCV5, we have Bluetooth on board. So about that a bit, uh, a bit later. And these devices are fully certified. Uh, their designs are validated and they're like fully legally available uh, for sale in Saudi Arabia. So we have CATC, we have European, EMARC and CE, uh, we have American and Canadian FCC and IC, and just, I believe, just just today we got a PTCRV certification as well, which shows uh, that uh, very high quality products, what we have today on the shelf. Speaking about uh, technical, technicalities, uh, so the devices are very versatile. We have four inputs for connecting uh, various uh, simple accessories. We have for uh, outputs uh, for connecting uh, various uh, accessories such as the buzzers, uh, ignition blocking relays, and similar things. And we have for analog inputs, so for connecting analog, uh, analog accessories, so for various use cases as well. Uh, so these devices, we have uh, CAMBUS interfaces. Uh, so it's, it, it can be used and it is mostly used to read CAMBUS data from the vehicle itself, such as a fuel level, RPMs, vehicle speed. Uh, and for some vehicles, we can read the uh, trouble codes and uh, for maybe European use cases, tachograph data, but all, all we have is here. Also, we have a one wire interface, so you can use for temperature, humidity monitoring, or driver identification. And it has also three serial ports, so um, it can be used for also smart accessories, such as smart card readers, snapshot cameras, I'll, uh, fatigue sensors and uh, uh, fuel level sensors and similar solutions. Uh, so these devices are very versatile and then can, can be upgraded, uh, you know, to, to, to cover multiple uh, use, use cases. Speaking about the values, how we differentiate these devices from our competition, which is really stronger, I believe. Uh, so first of all, we managed to combine two completely different things such as we allow our customers to reduce the time waste. At the same time, we, uh, we add more value to our solutions. And speaking about the time, we reduce time waste, we have many features that allows uh, to, save, to save time or costs uh, for our customers. First of all, the device is very nice in shape, very ergonomic, it's quite small in size. Installation is very quick, uh, we have, uh, various uh, wireless accessories uh, to reduce a uh, wiring needed to install AVL or GPS tracking solution in, in, inside the truck. Second thing, it has great performance. We have uh, no exceptions of performance. Uh, so uh, the, the most important thing is GPS tracking accuracy and performance, especially, especially in very difficult conditions. So for that, we, we use very premium, very expensive uh, Swiss-made U-Blocks uh, GPS uh, receivers uh, to cover that. And the devices are uh, really, we use uh, indus industrial grade components. Uh, so you can be sure that uh, there is very little prob probability that the devices or the tracking system installed inside the, the trucks will fail at some time. And as I mentioned, we have uh, simple Bluetooth enabled solutions, so various accessories, 
if, if in generation before we had to use various cables to connect them so today uh, many functions are available wirelessly via bluetooth so basically we allow our partners our customers our system integrators to reduce the time waste uh, and uh, ensure peace of mind and at the same time that what that we reduce like uh, complexity of using our solutions at the same time we add more value to our solutions so as i mentioned it has plenty of inputs and outputs and wireless connectivity serial ports to connect uh, lots of lots of different things depending on the exact case that you need uh, we use 4g uh, the future proof connectivity so you can be sure that the devices will be able to last on many on most of the markets for quite long of a time without uh, any risks that some networks will be shut down and uh, for similar reasons also the devices has very specific focus on improved safety and security the devices have tamper detection, jamming detection. It has internal and external antennas. So, uh, so it has accident and rollover detection solution as well as accident reconstruction solution. So that brings more security and safety to our customers, to fleet owners and our integrator partners. Speaking about the key highlights of HCV 5 and Pro 5, so basically the key benefits that our customers are receiving is, uh, first of all, we improve operational efficiency. So they reduce uh, costs uh, of uh, their uh, operations, of their fleet operations. Also, uh, it's very important, especially in very uh, dry and uh, hot climates, to ensure uh, proper delivery of uh, perishables of food, pharmaceuticals, or so-called cold chain solutions. So we allow to have a cold chain solution delivery at, at, at its best. And uh, also we can track a trailer, we can track a truck, uh, we can track uh, sensors, uh, wireless sensors, so we can have a full supply chain visibility. So you can track your, your devices, uh, check track, track your cargo going or trucks going from from one point to another while getting accurate reports. So just key features, so HCV5 is the most advanced device which is capable to read campus data or the connected vehicle data from the trucks. Um, multiple parameters are available. It can read campus data from the trailers directly. Uh, so it's also very useful for trailer renting businesses and similar things. Uh, we support some refrigerator data reading. So if you have refrigerators uh, supported model that we support, you can use together with our devices to get uh, thermograms, so like th uh, thermal reports. Uh, our devices can be used uh, for access control solutions, so to ensure that only authorized uh, drivers are driving the vehicle and uh, uh, many similar solutions. Uh, what is the new thing and uh, quite a new thing on the market? So we have Bluetooth connectivity and that allows a whole lot of good things uh, to improve the performance, to reduce uh, installation costs, and to reduce um, and to improve usability of our solutions. So uh, we have uh, wireless accessories such as temperature and humidity monitoring sensors, uh, driver identification sensor that you can see on the picture on the left, just to identify who is driving. Uh, the solutions can be used for trailer identification and uh, cargo identification. These solutions are coming very soon. And uh, like I mentioned, we put lots of focus on easy installation and maintenance. So these solutions used by our partners allow us really reduce and improve, reduce installation times, improve, reduce installation costs, and reduce probability for errors. So, so these devices are uh, quite capable, but still very easy to use. And you can see that in some cases we manage uh, to save installation time of like a full truck and trailer I believe it's three times. We managed to reduce more than three times uh, in installation times using our solution, comparing using various wireless sensors uh, compared to all generation solutions uh, from our competitors and, and similar and similar things. Uh, so that was about heavy duty vehicles. Uh, I will get back to the solutions very shortly. Just very quick introduction about our LCV5. So this device is very similar to previous ones. It has the same amount of inputs, outputs. However, it is optimized uh, to be used with light vehicles. Uh, so it's very suitable to use with car rental and leasing companies, with corporate fleets. 
uh, utilities, basically all companies that utilizes light commercial vans, uh, pickup trucks, uh, and uh, passenger vehicles. So that is solution that we targeting with the solution. Uh, and uh, how we work in Saudi Arabia. So uh, the solution is very well developed in Europe and we can use it using uh, our spe specific OBD harnesses. Uh, however, for Saudi Arabia, we provide uh, project based on demand vehicle integrations. So if you have any projects related to light vehicles, we would recommend our LCV solution. And for more information, uh, please approach uh, Mr. Amir from Ruptala. So, but today uh, we will not focus a lot on the light business, light vehicle businesses. So uh, getting back uh, to solutions uh, that are actually needed in Saudi Arabia. So Saudi, Saudi is a very important market for us. Uh, we are quite established and known brand in Saudi Arabia, and we are doing business in Saudi for quite a long time. And so we managed to uh, get quite good feedback, um, big thanks to our customers, to you guys, uh, about what we think and uh, what is what might be very beneficial uh, for you to expand your businesses. Uh, in to our understanding, so there are a few things that are like very important to have in this market. Uh, Feel free to comment them if uh, maybe I'm telling wrong, maybe you have something to add or to correct me. But what we believe that extremely high quality is a must in Saudi Arabia, especially what we noticed uh, that uh, some other uh, brands are failing due to extremely high temperatures, uh, uh, dust and other factors that are present in, in, in Saudi. So what we anticipate that our customers demands for very high or extremely high quality and durability of our products. Uh, then uh, in, in Saudi, we have a variety of governmental re regulations, such as a requirement for trackers to have some CATC approvals, to have some 4G connectivity, uh, to have 4G connectivity, uh, and, and, and similar uh, and other regulations. Also, uh, also, there are regulations related to uh, food, uh, pharmaceutical delivery, and so and many other regulations that we have to, uh, let's say, um, that we have to provide the solution to, uh, to ensure uh, like very efficient fleet management in Saudi. Uh, also, what is very important according to our customers, it's to ensure high quality delivery of perishables, food, pharmaceutical, and other goods that has to be under control temperature and humidity so so we we think that that's a very important thing and we have solution for that as well uh, also uh, i know that uh, there are regulations in saudi uh, that uh, regulates and controls uh, axle weight uh, limits of a truck uh, just to reduce um, damage to infrastructure and damage to the vehicle itself so we also have a few solutions on that. And uh, last but not least, uh, the oil industry is very important in Saudi Arabia. So we believe that ensuring safety and security for drivers, for vehicles, for cargo itself uh, is also essential. So that's what we believe is uh, uh, that, that, that are very important uh, things uh, that our solution should meet uh, to be successful in Saudi. And now let's get uh, through a uh, few solutions that we offer and we believe they are, they are quite important uh, in Saudi. So first of all, uh, we know that there are even governmental requirements to, to ensure the quality of, of food delivery, of pharmaceutical delivery uh, of, 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 of these goods. Uh, you know, the climate is quite hot, uh, arid, so if cargo is not delivered under required conditions, so it can just damage or destroy the cargo and incur losses, uh, huge losses uh, based on that. So, so that is very important to, to have solution that allows you to monitor uh, the humidity and temperature and other conditions of a cargo while it's being delivered and get reliable reports uh, and uh, documentation of these solutions. What we have to provide, so we have variety of sensors to fulfill this need. Uh, here you can see the example of our uh, one-wire temperature and humidity uh, sensor. 
uh, this is the, our latest addition to our solution. So now we can use uh, one sensor basically to track both temperature and humidity. You can connect up to four of these sensors to our devices and uh, just to track uh, the cargo conditions uh, that you have in your truck uh, or your cargo hold or your van or your or your vehicle. So better this that you have you get so you can be sure that the cargo was delivered under required conditions so you get a reliable and accurate temperature temperature and humidity uh, 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 let's say reporting so uh, then in this case you will reduce uh, uh, perishable cargo losses uh, you will reduce uh, complaints uh, from the customers that requires very strict, uh, some very strict, that has very strict requirements for high quality delivery, especially for food, pharmaceuticals or, 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 he or chemicals. So that's what we have, it's one wire uh, sensor. It's a wired solution, it's uh, very reliable. Uh, however, it may, it may be more difficult to connect. Uh, here you can see just an example uh, how typical solution looks like uh, here uh, on the top, you can see how it is installed in the truck. Sorry if the uh, letters are too small, uh, but uh, you can see that our tracker is installed into in the head unit of the truck uh, and the sensors are installed inside the trailer. So in this way, you can accurately track uh, the conditions throughout all your trailer. And uh, down below, you can see example how it can be done on commercial van. Uh, so, so this kind of solutions uh, are quite easy to use and very popular to use. and uh we support the solution so please approach uh, our uh, sales representative for saudi if you're interested to hear uh, more about that also we wanted to make life easier also for our partners and to, to, to bring more value to our customers so that's why I introduced a bluetooth based uh, temperature and humidity sensors uh, so what that allows to save some time it's avoids uh, lengthy and difficult installation and it's also perfect for cargo condition monitoring etc uh, however it's uh, installation uh, installation scenario might be might be different uh, but uh, feel free uh, to, to to approach uh, to approach us if you need this kind of solution we can we can recommend you how to do it in in, in a workable manner uh, another solution that might be useful uh, also in Saudi Arabia, it's a trailer recognition. It's a very popular solution in Europe. I'm not that sure about Saudi market, but it's very essential to know which trailer is connected to which truck. So today it's possible to do using uh, temperature sensors, uh, but also we allow to do that using uh, wireless sensors. You just place a sensor on the trailer, and uh, when the truck connects to the trailer, uh, it can it will be able to automatically tell you which trailer is connected to which. So you can be sure that your truck is is has connected to a right trailer, uh, and the cargo will not be lost uh, somewhere somewhere else. Uh, another solution that we hear a lot from our dear from our dear customers in Saudi in, in Saudi, so it's axle weight monitoring. Uh, what we hear, there are uh, some strict local limits about how heavy uh, trucks can be, how many cargo can be loaded. Uh, we, we, we know that uh, some, uh, some operators or some, some drivers are tending to overload trucks, uh, so that, that might cause some also fines, some problems with uh, uh, government as well as it... Uh, uh, how to say damages uh, little by little your car because it's overloaded so you will spend more on maintenance uh, etc so this kind of axle weight monitoring solutions allows you to accurately track track uh, what are the loads on, on 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 your truck also it allows to measure the cargo weight and it allows you to be to rest assured that you your trucks are not overloaded and you will not get uh, any fines from police or related agencies uh, how we do the solution. So uh, as for today, uh, we support various uh, third party uh, sensors, let's say, uh, that works very well together with our uh, fleet management solutions. So depending on your exact needs of your truck type, uh, we provide uh, 
from several brands uh, weight sensors uh, we support. Uh, for example, we support the uh, Keymax weight se sensors. Uh, however, you have to approach them directly uh, to agree on the installation, but uh, these sensors are fully support. Uh, also, we support Technotone uh, wireless and wired uh, weight sensors that you can hook up to your axis and you can get, uh, you can calibrate them and then you can get uh, an exact uh, weight uh, weight of your uh, truck, truck load, uh, et cetera. So you can control how much cargo is loaded, if any, that if you meet the governmental requirements or if you need it, you can pass the reports to wherever it's needed. So yeah, that's for actual weight monitoring. Uh, one of the problems uh, what uh, causes uh, huge expenses to fleet operators or owners is uh, when the drivers are driving, uh, let's say, uh, quite widely. Uh, so dangerous or aggressive driving style, uh, you probably know it, uh, uh, it increases fuel consumption, it uh, increases uh, wear of a vehicle, so more problems, technical faults might uh, occur. Uh, that increases maintenance costs. And of course, aggressive driving can cause um, an accident, which you know can destroy cargo, it can destroy uh, vehicle itself, and it might, in worst case, it might even kill a driver. So uh, we have way uh, many solutions that allows us to ensure or to let's say, reduce probability for this kind of accidents to happen and also to reduce uh, wear and tear of a vehicle by educating driver uh, how to drive, uh, by detecting uh, bad driving habits and reporting them back uh, to the manager or operation center and this kind of uh, things. Many of these features are inbuilt into our trackers, so you, you don't need any uh, additional accessories, let's say, uh, to use this kind of solution. So we have uh, Echo Drive. So basically our tracker can track if a driver is accelerating too, too aggressively or he is uh, cornering uh, very aggressively or doing some uh, other, uh, let's say, bad things that increases uh, fuel waste and increases uh, the maintenance cost of a vehicle. So you, we can detect and track with all this kind of um, behavior of the drivers and report them back. Also, uh, we have an accident and rollover detection feature. Uh, maybe accident is not, accident detection is not that reliable or heavy due to trucks. However, rollover detection is very nice feature to detect if the truck or the trailer uh, rolled, uh, over, rolled over, basically came into an accident. So we can detect that and that allows us, uh, it allows us or you, our customers, to know very, very, brief, very quickly that something is happening, and you can send the help uh, to the driver or call the ambulance, and and similar things. So these many of these features are supported by, by the tracker itself. However, we have many additional features that can be used uh, together with some accessories. Uh, on the screen, you can see our own developed Echo Panel. Uh, typical uh, fleet management solutions, we just uh, track and monitor how the driver is driving and send this data to, uh, to the server. Uh, but uh, that has some drawbacks. First of all, driver does not get any instant feedback that he's doing something wrong. So only after some days, he gets maybe phone call uh, from his boss telling that you are driving really bad, in a very bad way, you should improve and you are wasting our money or you are damaging the vehicle itself. So that's what the most fleet management solution does. However, this echo panel, it, it is installed inside the truck. It allows the driver uh, in the real time to get feedback what he's doing. Here in this echo panel, we use visual and audio signals uh, to alert uh, the driver if he is over speeding, if he is uh, exceeding his uh, engine RPMs to unsafe limits, if he is braking uh, very uh, harshly braking, or he's accelerating very uh, harshly, which also damages damages engine and uh, consumes lots of fuel. So all this kind of behavior can be directly communicated to the driver automatically by our tracker using echo panel. So that allows the driver to be educated, not only monitored, but 
uh, it's not only driver behavior monitoring, but driver behavior education. So little by little, you can improve driving skills of your driver. That will result in less accidents, in uh, less fuel consumption, and less uh, maintenance cost uh, to, your, to your vehicles. Another solution that was uh, quite recently introduced, uh, which is available uh, for sale from Ruptella directly, uh, it's a fatigue sensor. So uh, the, basically, I, um, I believe you, many of you heard the solution. It's a sort of camera that sits in front of a driver. It tracks driver's eyes. And if a driver is distracted by something, if he is not looking at the road, if he turns his head to see, I don't know, some nice pictures or some nice views, or he uh, falls asleep, uh, it automatically detects this kind of event. It in in the voice it alerts the driver that you should like wake up, uh, look at the road, or do something else that you are doing something bad, and also it reports to, to the server, the accessory. So. In using this, that would allow to uh, greatly improve security, uh, I mean, not security, but safety of your uh, of your drivers and your cargo. So less probability for driver to fall asleep, less probability for driver to get in, get into accident because he was using phone or some um, similar things. So that solution that we have today, it's an accessory that you can connect to our HCV5 uh, or Pro5 uh, devices today. So. That's quite an uh, interesting solution. Uh, another thing is uh, related to uh, safety and security. Uh, we know that uh, there are quite, uh, how to say, bad people that are not willing to use uh, vehicles properly, uh, uh, that uh, there are some robberies happening to our customers, cargo is getting stolen, vehicles are getting stolen. Uh, drivers are getting harmed or even in bad, worst case killed and uh, this just adds to the losses to our fleet to fleet operators uh, to cargo companies uh, so a lot we, we put lots of focus to improving uh, privacy data security and the safety and the theft prevention itself so let's go one by one uh, speaking from the device itself uh, uh, Speaking about the devices itself, so we have inbuilt many features that can be used with solutions quite standalone. First of all, it has it has four uh, digital inputs and four analog inputs. In this case, you can connect many sensors that allows to prevent uh, or to ensure the security of a vehicle. You can connect a panic button that the driver can call the help uh, or inform about some situation happening so you can use that you can connect uh, door sensors so you can be sure that nobody is opening uh, trailer doors or cargo doors uh, without you knowing that so you can install door sensors also it has for outputs you can connect some very basic things such as buzzers or led lights uh, just to alert the driver if something is happening if uh, if someone is trying to open some doors or if someone is trying to jam the GSM signal in order to rob the driver. So we can, uh, we can, we, we can detect all that. And, uh, and we, what we can do, we can block the engine or alert the driver uh, by using buzzer or LED light. Also, these new devices we have inbuilt internal antennas. Typically, it was situations when some bad guys came and just they just cut the antenna, cut the antennas uh, in order to avoid some uh, developments. Uh, so, I mean, to, to to prevent getting caught uh, of doing something bad. So, in these devices, we have internal ones, and what is more interesting, which is pretty much unique, we have both two antennas, internal and external. If you cut external antenna, it will switch automatically to internal antenna. So that's very good for uh, security improvements. Also, our trackers has uh, TLS 1.2 data encryption possibility to prevent uh, data interception and interpretation by unauthorized, uh, I don't know, hackers or some other bad guys. So this, this, we have this possibility to be used to get to, together with our solutions. Uh, 
we have inbuilt tamper detection. What does it mean to you? Uh, one of the cases when the drivers or some um, uh, thefts, uh, thieves, uh, when they wanted to uh, steal the car, steal the, the vehicle, uh, we try to find the device uh, first. What we do, we typically open the device and we take out the SIM card. So by this time, it's the device, it's all dead, not sending anything. Here we have inbuilt tamper detection. So if you open the housing immediately, you will get notification in the server side or by SMS uh, alerting you that someone intentionally tries to sabotage uh, the fleet management installed inside the truck. So that's what are inbuilt inside the tracker. And uh, we have some other quite good solutions that are based on some accessories. So, so first of all, we have a good old uh, wired uh, driver identification solution such, for example, we can connect RFID cards to our devices and the driver, if he wants to, to drive the car, he has to touch his RFID card to the reader that you can see on the left side. And if he is authorized, he can, then he will be allowed uh, to drive a vehicle. Uh, if he is not authorized, we can block the vehicle from starting the engine. So this quite, these are quite examples of uh, safe access to the vehicle solutions. We have multiple card readers. Uh, on the right side of the picture, you can see I button readers that are also convenient to use to identify who is driving. So that basically improves the security and ensures that only authorized personnel is driving the car. I believe uh, just to take an example, not from Saudi, but from example from uh, Brunei in Southeast Asia, for example, in their oil industry, it is a must that only authorized people are driving, uh, uh, are driving uh, cars. Um, so, so these solutions can be probably reused very well in, in, in Saudi as well in these very safety and security related uh, sectors like oil. Also, in addition to a wired solutions, we have a wireless uh, driver identification solution. Uh, so that basically acts in the same way, like I mentioned with a wired solution, uh, just that we are wireless, we are based on Bluetooth. You can, this is very small fob, you can attach it to your key keys and the driver, when he approaches the car, he has just to double click it uh, and uh, it will be identified. So basically we are moving with fifth generation from a wired solution to wireless solution. So, but just for you to have, we have this quite, this, this solution for sale already. So please uh, try using that as well. Uh, also, what we have, we have a camera solution available. Uh, just to be just to clarify, this is not a solution that are filming. These are just taking pictures. So no, no video, but just pictures. And that solution is very, very good just to understand what is happening inside the cabin uh, or outside the vehicle or inside the trailer, inside the cargo hold. You know, it depends where you install them. So you can trigger the taking picture by server command, by SMS message, uh, or by the tracker itself, depending on some conditions. For example, if you, you can configure it uh, to take a picture, if, for example, button, some panic button is pressed. It depends on the configuration, basically. So it, it stores all pictures locally in SD card, and uh, our protocol allows uh, also to upload these pictures from our SD card to the server, or you can just uh, manually remove SD card and check what the pictures were made. Uh, these cameras, we, we have one indoor, with, which is not waterproof, and we have outdoor version, which is waterproof and can be used externally. And all, also these cameras uh, has uh, night vision mode. So we automatically switch to infrared night vision mode when it's dark. So you can take pictures even in the dark cabins during the nighttime. So in general, it just improves security and general safety of a solution of, of, of a driver and cargo um, itself. So also quite nice solution. And uh, moving on, um, in some countries, I'm not sure to be honest about the Saudi Arabia because I know that uh, fuel prices are very low. Please comment if I'm wrong, but I believe the fuel prices are very low in Saudi. So uh, let me know if you have uh, fuel theft problems because 
uh, for example, in Europe, in Eastern Europe, in Asian countries, uh, in African countries, we have situations that uh, people are trying to steal the fuel uh, from the trucks. So what we provide, provide solutions that allows to accurately track uh, fuel level inside the truck uh, using various solutions and that allows to prevent fuel thefts. Uh, so if try, someone trying to steal the fuel, you will be able to, to see that on your uh, server side. And also it allows you to effectively monitor which driver is using how much fuel and to you know allow to educate drivers or take some other actions or to switch to more economical vehicles to reduce uh, fuel consumption. Uh, fuel consumption of your vehicles and to reduce operational efficiency costs uh, of your businesses. And we do that using um, several ways. One way is, we is that we can get a campus data directly from the vehicle and we can get a fuel level directly from the vehicle itself, but uh, the vehicle fuel level sensors in built sensors are not that accurate. So there are a huge market of available aftermarket fuel level solutions that can be installed inside the fuel uh, trucks. Uh, and uh, they provide much higher degree of accuracy that allows to detect uh, the fuel thefts and uh, more precise uh, fuel level uh, monitoring solutions. Uh, so today uh, we have even our own branded uh, Ruptella FLS solutions that are wired. You can install and connect to our devices. Also, we have solutions from our partners as well, very well known names like RCS, Technoton, Omnicom, these are also supported by us, uh, by us, uh, by Ruptella devices. So you can have plenty of choice what you want to use depending on your exact cases. And addition to the fifth generation, uh, we already support uh, a wireless battery powered fuel level sensor from Technoton. So that allows very easy installation. So no cables are needed. These devices operate on battery, so also not even cables are not needed even for powering up. And uh, yep, yeah, these are supported and very, very easy to use, and I strongly recommend to try them out. As for today, we support uh, like a primary, one, one of the best products on the market, Bluetooth solutions on the market, it's from Technoton, uh, DUT ES7. And we also support uh, some sensors from provider of called the Escort. I mean, these are two providers that we support a uh, wireless uh, fuel level monitoring uh, systems. So I did not get any comment if it's uh, fuel level monitoring is relevant uh, in Saudi, but okay, let me be next time. So I, I mentioned the key uh, solutions and key accessories that we believe are essential and important to have uh, in Saudi Arabia related to your own governmental regulations and problematic that you have here. But uh, don't be uh, fooled. Uh, we have many others also available, but they are just too, too small you know, to mention. We have, um, of course, we have uh, various buttons. We have ignition blocking relays. Uh, we have uh, simple temperature sensors, not a humidity. Uh, we have door sensors you can see. You, I don't, you don't see my mouse, but never mind. So we have many of our accessories. So please refer to our uh, sales representative Amir uh, for a, like a full catalog if some solutions are still missing. And uh, basically, uh, oh, spoiler alert. Uh, but I have one last question. Uh, you can you will see a poll. So I mentioned several solutions today. And I would like you to fill the poll, which of the solutions that I just mentioned are the most relevant to you. You can pick only one, the most relevant to you. So you can see a uh, poll on your screen, so please vote. Okay, we have one for axle weight monitoring. Temperature and humidity, okay. Temperature, we have two answers. Someone voted for driver behavior monitoring, so please guys. Only 26% of our auditory uh, voted. Okay, still voting. Let's give some time. Let's have like 20 seconds more and... <laughs> come, by, come on guys, don't be shy, please vote. Because if you see something, uh, what we have 
we think differently. Uh, so we might like change the product. We are flexible on that. Okay, so so thank you. So I see that uh, the most, and you see, you can see as well, the like the most of you voted on temperature and humidity monitoring. Oh, it's a winner right now. Also, axle weight and the cargo load monitoring are important. Uh, okay, the, the guess was right. Fuel level monitoring is not important uh, in in this market. Okay, so thank you for your poll. It gives us very good in, 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 insights. Uh, about what is needed on the market. If something was missing inside the poll, uh, please write the comments that some maybe other solutions are very important to you. Uh, so let us know. We, we will definitely dig into dig into the dig into that, and maybe we will include into our roadmap. Uh, so presentation is almost coming to an end, uh, but uh, that's not uh, everything. Uh, I'm very glad to announce that we have an uh, exclusive offer, which is valid uh, until the December 4th, uh, 4th of December this year. So you can get up to 20% discount for all fifth generation uh, trackers. Uh, of course, limited quantities are available, only limited quantities are available. And you can see a pop-up in your screens. Please uh, Press get the offer and you can fill the information and we will reach you out with the best offer probably that we can offer to you. Okay, let's uh, move on. So in general, I just want to conclude uh, all the discussion uh, with, uh, let's say, summary by Ruptella. So it's, I mentioned a lot about the products itself. So our products are reliable. We have for, for a long time, we have them on the market. We are very well developed and trusted. But as a Ruptella, we have uh, we, we can provide also other values. So first of all, uh, we can provi provide close partnerships. So we are always open to do adaptation and customizations according to your needs. Uh, we try to listen to your feedback and uh, we try to do the sessions together with our customers. So basically, we allow customers to build our product, let, let's say, through, through our hands. So uh, that is uh, valued by our customers, I believe, as well. Also, we are not uh, that shy, and uh, the knowledge that we get in other 120 countries, in more than 120 countries, we get lots of different knowledge from different regions, and we are very willing to share these solutions. For example, if something is successful in, in, in South America, we always are willing to bring it to, to you guys, to like uh, Gulf region, to tell like, look, this kind of solution is very promising here. Maybe you would like to try and to get some advantage over your competition. Uh, so, so, so we 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 have uh, we have we, we have that, and also. Uh, we, we can be one single technology provider. So we can provide the product development, we can we are manufacturing it, we are doing our own hardware. And for uh, some, uh, some, uh, some customers, we can provide our own soft software. Uh, so you can have uh, all these kind of solutions from one hand. And uh, what also differentiates us from, from others, so we have quite deep technical support that is willing to speak in many different languages. Uh, to to adapt to language of our customers, uh, we pro we are providing and sharing uh, manuals, and instructions how to do things. As, as I mentioned, we are very willing to to share our know how. We provide onboarding and trainings on site, how to do, how to install trackers, and to do this kind of things. And we also have a client onboarding program, which runs through very smooth process. Uh, to onboard our customer with uh, either new solutions or new customer at all. Uh, so that was uh, the last slide. Uh, so guys, uh, if you have any questions, please uh, write in the chat uh, right now. I hope that most of your questions that were uh, given before, I hope my, my colleagues managed to answer them. If not, uh, you can see a contact for our uh, key account manager for, 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 for Saudi market, uh, Mr. Amir Fakri. Uh, so please do not hesitate to contact him and uh, uh, demand for solution that you need. So we can think of something, I believe, in any, in any case. Okay, I see that uh, we have no questions. So I will conclude then. Uh, 
video of this presentation will be available uh, afterwards. So you can you will be able to check it later on and also show to your colleagues. And uh, please approach us if you see that something was interesting for you. Please approach us. We will we will try our best to to help you and provide the solution that you need. Uh, so have a good day and bye bye.